on that Wednesday night before the flood, we had went to church and uh, Steve and our son and his wife Elena and their eight-year-old daughter had come to church and uh, when we got ready to leave, little Bridget wanted to come and go home with us and we tried to get Stephen and Elena to come, but they said they were going to go back home. And uh, as the river came down, the water got more intense and whatever, and where they live beside the river at Relief, it just came down all at once and took them. Stephen was found in Irwin, Tennessee, and we have done done the funeral for him and Elena is still not found. Little Bridget is eight year old and uh, she'll be staying with us and the other grandparents is gonna, we're all gonna work together and make for sure that she's well taken care of. So even though we've lost a son, we have the hope of going to be with him one day and proud of my son and proud of my whole family. It is unimaginable the way that our community and fire departments and different organizations done for us far and above that we could even imagine. It's just been overwhelming the way that people has helped and done and wanting to help and we just thank each and everybody that's done anything for us. With all of our heart we pray and ask God that he would bless you as you've blessed us.